Okay, that's better. Okay, that's better. Okay, no sense in creating any of this feedback loop. Okay. Uh, right. Okay. Uh, just gonna. All right. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, your boy. Uh, I am back. Uh, I know this is not what I said I was gonna do, but surprisingly, I'm very indecisive and you know terrible at making decisions so we're just gonna get started a little bit early yeah that's all no problemo i need someone to show me my place in all this okay ray let, let let me be completely honest with you your place is literally at the bottom of the barrel 
All right, so let's uh, let's get into this. Uh, one moment, I gotta do do something. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. Yeah, I I know. I'm taking forever and being very hesitant. Okay, yeah, okay, let's, uh, let's get into this. Whenever the icon is shown, the game is saving. Got it. Okay, and we are going to continue game. Yes, I want to confirm, con confirm the load and such. Load successful. I, I would hope so, because if it was unsuccessful, that means I've lost all my progress from last video, and that is just not good. Right, so I could free play if I want, or I could not. And, and yeah, we're just, we're gonna not. Because I am in very much of a hurry to get to episode 3, because that's my favorite Star Wars episode. It's the best episode. But, but currently we're focusing on one of the rather boring episodes, you know, episode 2. The one with the talk of sand. It's sadness. Attack of the clones. There's an unrest in the Galactic Senate. Several thousand solar systems have declared their independent... Their... reason to leave the Separatist movement under the leader of the mysterious Count Dooku has made a different... even number of Jedi Knights to maintain peace and order across the galaxy. Senator Amidala, the former Queen of Naboo, is returning to the Galactic Senate to vote... On the critical issue of creating the army of the Republic to assist in the ov the overwhelmed Jedi. Ah yes, the army of the Republic. You know, I see in no way how that could possibly backfire. You know, a bunch of really weird space monks making horrible decisions of war. No way that could possibly go wrong. No way. Oh, oh, oh. Senator. We're making our final approach towards Coruscant. Very good, Lieutenant. <laughs> oh, that poor man. Poor, poor man. We made it. shouldn't have come back. This vote is very important. Now come. <laughs> Just everyone's alive, you know, it's fine. That explosion, you know, the massive explosion killed literally no one. No one at all. Everyone is fine. Responsible. You did your duty, just as she did hers. Now let's take a transport to the Senate. Uh, my guy. That, that, that's pretty clearly a dude. Like, seriously, he's got a beard and everything. Pretty, uh, pretty clearly a dude, my guy. They were just gonna break stuff, you know. You know how it be.
Okay, so we're just gonna... I wonder, can I randomly shoot civilians? Aha, I can! I'm Queen of Deadeye. Everyone is fine. No one is hurt at all. Everyone is completely fine. <laughs> Why is this fun? I have ser I have a serious problem. What is this, America? Okay, da da. I've been given a blaster, and this game expects me not to shoot people. Who do they think I am? The queen of a place called Naboo. Just, just what are they expecting? You ever miss the Star Wars Battlefront games? Uh, okay, okay. I feel like I've gotten the murder out of my... I had not, in fact, gotten the murder out of my system. But I'm pretty sure now that my, you know, murderous bloodlust is gone. Well, I suppose bloodlust is the wrong word. It's probably more just, you know, desperate need to see things break apart. Looking to get across the planet? Rest whatever it is you use for legs and pop in one of these. Okay, to the city. Safe building. travels, friend. All right. We are at the Senate building. You know, this this looks very pretty. Just, just like, take a moment to admire all this, my guy. Like, seriously. Wowzers. I mean, look at that. You even got a Wookiee trying to read. But you know me, I gotta ruin his day. No one gets to read on my watch. No reading. I'm not going to sign your petition, boy. I'm a murderous sociopath with a long history of violence. So much so that I'm going to marry literally a man who wants to do fascism to a senate. You know, Anakin. Okay, and... We're just gonna collect some... Collect some bits. You know, do as one does. Okay, and in we go. Also, I am sorry about how, uh, how if you're watching uh, this Senator, on Twitch, it looks about the really late. on the landing platform. It is a great relief to know that you are okay. Um... Okay, aren't those supposed to be, like, weird spirit urns? Because, like, he keeps the ashes of his master- of his former master, Darth Plagueis, in one of them. Nothing. Come on, I want to break the window. And it gets shattered in the movies. 
Okay, now now I think we're good. Senator Amidala, your tragedy on the landing platform. Terrible. I think that Count Dooku was behind it. Count Dooku was once a Jedi. He couldn't assassinate anyone. <laughs> Master Jedi, may I Slight suggest foreshadowing. to be placed under the protection of your graces? Perhaps someone you're familiar with. Annie? My goodness, you've grown. So have you. Subtle foreshadowing, guys. Very subtle. Grown more beautiful, I mean. V very subtle, Anakin. Very, very subtle. The smoothest and most subtlest guy to ever be a, you know, Jedi. Well, now that everyone's been reacquainted, allow us to escort you to your quarters, Senator. Thank you, Master Kenobi, but this seems unnecessary. I don't need more security. I need answers. I need to know who's trying to kill me. We're here to protect you, Senator, not to start an investigation. Hey, uh... There we go! That's how you raise someone up in the air. Okay. Sorry, it's been a hot minute since the last episode. Gotta get reacquainted with the controls. We will find out who's trying to kill you, Padme. I promise you. We will not exceed our mandate, my young Padawan learner. I meant it in the interest of protecting her master, of course. Okay, so Perhaps you know, the lightsaber throw goes presence, far. The mystery surrounding this threat will be revealed. Okay. No, no, that's not what I want. No. Okay. This is much farther, Master. Is mine and Padme's company boring you already, my Padawan? No, uh, of course not, Master. I, I didn't mean. We aren't far. My apartment is just up ahead. Okay. How do I? How how do I switch to Anakin? Oh, there we are. There we go. Much, much better. Now I have a cape. Here we are. Shall we? Okay, so Thank bright light. Thank you for getting here safely. Now, if you'll excuse me, I will retire. Padme, you're too young to retire. You're not in your 60s yet. Where is he? I know he's here. Where is the gun gun? I, I I just want to talk to Darth Plagueis. You know, the real Sith Lord of the prequels. Jar Jar Binks. Where is he? I simply want to talk. Okay. Da -da -da. Okay, and just gonna break some more stuff. You know how it be, nothing major. Wait, what? Okay, so we, oh, we can apparently switch to R2. Interesting. Yes, let's start a new level. Let's get into some action that isn't just walking around. The art of subtlety. That is what I'm going to call this episode. Just the plain art of subtlety. <laughs> what the hell? Wow. 
ones. Just, just, just what even? There she is. Don't let her get away. And be precise with your shots. There are civilians everywhere. We'll stop her, Master. I promise. Great. Well, if we could not crash before doing so, I'd greatly appreciate it. Master, you need to relax. I'm a great pilot. You've much to learn about many things, my young apprentice. And flying is certainly one of them. Oh, okay, so I can speed up with A and get a bit closer. Okay, so the electric things work as like a weird EMP. Has your brain turned into sand, Anakin? Stop firing at the civilians! Never! Anakin, watch out for that power coupling! Everything is perfectly fine. Where, uh... Where, where is the person I'm supposed to be? Oh, there they are. Okay, so now we're just gonna fire at them a bit more. Just a little bit more, and we should Ahead. be good. They've gone in that tunnel. We almost have them. Okay, one thing I will say so far. So far, this game has been far more accurate to the movies than the complete saga was. And I have not been expecting that for some reason. Like, it's so much more accurate. <laughs> Especially some of these level designs. Like, it genuinely feels you're playing a parody of the films. Well, I guess parody is the wrong word. Just more that you're playing through a more jokey version of the original films. Okay, just gonna... Keep on the Nanakin. Has my flying improved, Master? Well, I'm still alive, so there's that. <laughs> yeah, still alive proceeds to immediately die. <laughs> I remember, this was one of my favorite set pieces from the original film. Oh, but we don't... <laughs> Whoa. Huh. Who hired you? It was a bounty hunter called... Toxic dart. Hmm. Huh? We'll have to split up. Escort Senator Amidala back to Naboo. She'll be safer there. Oh, come of on. Course, Do we Master. not get to meet Ellen Slee's Bagano? I think you can help me with something. The best character in all of Star Cruise Wars. Apart, buy and sell. I would rather sell. An old friend at the diner nearby knows all about this sort of thing. Let's see if he recognizes this dart, shall we? Okay. But are you kidding me? We don't get to meet the best character, Ellen Slees Bagano? That is, that is Boosh. I need to meet Ellen Slee's Bagano, the best character. I want him to offer me death stick. Okay, I can see why we didn't meet him. I, I can definitely see why we didn't meet him. Makes perfect Blast sense now. Blast a scope! Blast a silencer! 
I got everything for a blaster except the blaster itself. But you already got one, I can tell. Okay, so they only sell blaster accessories. I sell propane and propane accessories. Okay, let's move forward. All right, don't blow your top. I'm going fast as I can. <laughs> That's Dex. Let's see what the problem is. You've uh, caught me at a bad time. My best waitress, Wanda, has blown a fuse, and I can't keep up with all these customers. Think you could help out an old buddy and take some orders to the right tables? I gotta fix up old Wanda. Soon as we get finished, I'm all yours. But what do you say? Wait! All you gotta do is find out what each customer ordered and take them the right dish. If a droid can do it, I'm sure a Jedi can. Honestly, I would not count on it. Can you go get my photon fizzle? It's bright green, you can't miss it. Okay, so it's the green thing. It's the bright green thing. Here you go. Ugh, better late than never. At this point, it would have been quicker to fly to Naboo and cook my own Nuna drumstick. Okay, so chicken. Da, da, da. Wow, let me add it. These people are lucky I can't kill them. I want to go an episode three Anakin on people. But I gotta wait like one more week before I can. Any news on my 6-6 six -six layer cake? I haven't seen one layer since I got here. Got it, so the cake. That's it, thanks a lot. Nothing like a tall cup of Jawa juice. Where's that waitress gone? Okay, uh, Jawa juice. Uh, is this it? My Jawa juice, thanks. Okay, what do you want, my guy? Where's my shot of club sandwich? My pocket meter runs out in five minutes. Okay. Let's get this man a sandwich. Okay, I've got your comedically oversized sandwich Looks here, sir. Delicious. Okay, why am I working fast food in a Star Wars game? Oh, you can actually go back here. Neato burrito. Oh, so that's how you do a quick switch. Okay. Did everyone get their orders? Great! I really owe you one. And so this Wanda took a fair bit of elbow grease, but I'm happy to say she'll be back washing tables in no time. Now, what do you want to talk about? Grab a seat and I'll be right with you. Okay, let's talk about Tell some what murder. This is. What you got here is a Camino saber dart. Camino, I'm not familiar with it. Is it in the Republic? No, no, it's beyond the outer rim. These uh, Camino ones <laughs> keep to themselves. <laughs> They're <laughs> kroners. <laughs> Cloners. <laughs> yeah, no you know, just for. casual I murder. Camino on any of the usual charts. Let's head to the archive. <laughs> you know, a very casual, of Camino, very slight. Let's murder. run the coordinates Dex gave us through the Jedi archives. See if we can find out more about it. Okay, but before we do that, I actually got to do something real quick. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's move that over here a bit. Better be prepared, just in case. It never hurts to be, you know, overly prepared for stuff. You know how it... Why, hello, suspicious-looking stranger. All the empty ships parked around the city. The Jedi Order confiscated them from various villains. Now, they just sit unattended and unloved. 
No idea how long some of them have been sat there, actually. I suppose it wouldn't hurt to give them a bit of a runaround before the engines seize up. Well, you look incredibly suspicious. Okay, so let's do a quick little run here. And let's get to Kamino, the best planet in all of Star Wars. Fight me. I'm not going to do your petty side quests. You need potatoes? I got sacks of them. Full of protein and delicious when fried. There are no cons to buying potatoes. You know, I should get some potatoes. Potato sounds really good right about now. Okay, I'm acknowledging that I may be a food addict. I just really like food. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, and da 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 da. Okay, so we gotta go to the Jedi archives. To the federal district. District. Yes. You know, fun fact, George Lucas's son was actually the Padawan in uh, Star Wars Episode 2 Welcome during the, the library Federal theme. District of Coruscant. And I, Cora, thank you for your custom. Not sure that one works there, buddy, but okay. Man, I'm so happy we don't have to deal with that terrible Anakin subplot. To the Jedi we'll be Temple. There in no time. You know, I think it's because we're uh, going in the wrong direction, but okay. Alright, let's go do some research. Everyone's favorite activity. Why is the light for the level transition so bright? I don't understand. Get back here and fight me, kiddo. You cannot run forever, boy. Seriously, I'm trying to do an aerial combo on this kid. Okay, so I think it's like... He is frozen with fear. Fear will guide them. Seriously, why are the level transitions so bright? Okay, R4. Upload the data Dex gave us to the terminal. Okay, to R4. Okay, so it's just that. Oh, all right. Uh, let's continue the story. According to Dex, Camino should be right here, but there's just empty space. Hmm. Lost a planet. Master Obi Wan has. How embarrassing. There's nothing there. Gravity silhouette remains. There is a "that's what she said" huh? joke there, and I swear it. Very good. Go to the center of gravity's pole and find your planet. You will. But Master Yoda, who could empty information from the archives? That's impossible, isn't it? Only a Jedi could have erased those files. But who and why? Hard to answer. 
Meditate on this, I will. Isn't isn't this the librarian? I wonder if I can hit people with other Be stuff. Careful with those. So I can't just violently throw things like in the Force Unleashed. Unfortunate. So I did find a mod that, you know, actually adds Starkiller uh, to the game, which... When I inevitably do, like, some free play in my spare time, I'm definitely getting that mod. Because Starkiller is, like, my favorite Star Wars character. Like, ever. He's just like, what if Darth Vader had a violent apprentice? And I'm like, yes, give us the violent savior. <laughs> Hooray! Three We're cheers for the violent savior! Here. No apps, no drivers, no problem. Enjoy your trip. <laughs> okay. So da 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 da. I've had a fresh update, so my existence has meaning again, apparently. I I'm sorry. What did you just say? Someone went to a lot of effort to collect this database, didn't they? Hope you found what you needed. Blah blah blah. Go on, get out of here. I mean, okay, I guess. That was surprisingly dark. <laughs> oh, you know, had a fresh update, therefore my life has meaning. What do you mean by that, you poor soul? Seriously, that loading screen is just so interesting. I like it. Yes, this should be the right system. Keep your eyes peeled. Okay, and down we go. Okay, and here we are, on Camino. Ah, nothing like the rain. Master Jedi, I've been expecting you. Welcome. After all these years, I was beginning to think you weren't coming. I'm expected. Of course. Please tell your master that his order will be completed on time. 200,000 units are ready, with a million more on the way. I'm sure he'll be quite proud of the army we've built for him. The army? Yes, a clone army. But you must be anxious to inspect the units for yourself. Now please, this way. When my master first contacted you about the army, did he say who it was for? Of course he did. Master Saifu Diaz ordered this army for the Republic. I'm sorry, Master Saifu Diaz? But he was killed almost ten years ago. I'm so sorry to hear that. Uh, okay, so... Very impressive. I'd hoped you would be pleased. Clones can think creatively. You will find that they are immensely superior to droids. I'm sure they're not talking about you, R4. These clones, how old are they? Oh, yes. 
We use growth acceleration. Otherwise, a mature clone would take a lifetime to grow. I see. They are totally obedient, taking any order without question. We modify their genetic structure to make them less independent than the original host. And who was the original host? A bounty hunter called Django Fett. A bounty hunter? I would very much like to meet this Django Fett. And I would be very happy to arrange it for you. Apart from his pay, which is considerable, Fett demanded only one thing, an unaltered clone for himself. Curious, isn't it? Unaltered? Pure genetic replication. No tampering with the structure to make it more docile, and no growth acceleration. So he just wanted a son. That's, that's literally all he asked for. What is this? What is it, like a key card or something? Okay, sure, we won't be needing that. By no means will that be important, I'm sure. This is Django's room. Would you like to meet him? Django, huh? welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> this is Jedi Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. He's come to check on our progress. Your clones are very impressive. You must be very proud. Huh? Hmm. Who hired you for this job? I was recruited by a man called Tyrannus. Do you like your army? <laughs> Yes, very intelligent. Very, very intelligent. I look forward to seeing them in action. Thank you for your time, Django. <clears throat> Always a pleasure to meet a Jedi. I have a strong feeling that this bounty hunter is the assassin we're looking for. <laughs> right, well... If our suspicions are correct, he'll be wanting to leave quickly. We best head to the nearest landing pad. Well, you know how it be. Gotta go, uh, go, go talk to this guy. You know, figure out what he wants. Oh, we're doing a boss fight. Oh, okay. Look, the Jedi! Soba, get on board. I'll handle this. I don't think you will. Now stand still. I only wish to talk. No, just standard boss fight tactics. Come on, put up more of a fight. I can see why they wanted to clone him. Come on, no friendly banter. Mustn't let them get too far ahead. Let's go. Okay, so false reflexes have their advantages on for. Now there's no time to waste. Let's follow him. Ah oh, yes, force reflexes. So uncivilized. Okay, so Okay, so I can't get on to there, unfortunately. How perplexing. I presume you have spied that strange artifact up there. Okay, so they're, they're just fishing. What are they, Jack, in the middle of playing Sea of Thieves? I know, I am a master of subtlety. Okay, 
case of death. Okay, yeah, nope, not gonna get up there. There's no time to lose. We must follow this Django character. Why would you mop on Geonosis? Because, like, in all honesty, it's constantly raining like you're going through a hurricane. So, what would be the point of mopping it, like, at all? Like, like that just seems uh, very, uh, I don't know, seems very counterproductive because it's going to always be raining, so why would you even bother? Pretty sure people track water in it, like, every day. Oh, well. Okay, to Camino Space. Okay, so I assume we're gonna be uh, fighting Django and trying to outmaneuver him in a ship. Okay, hunt for Django. Okay, so. Oh, is this part where we get to do a bit of dog fighting? Yeah! Tracked. How did they not notice Hang that? On, son, we'll like, move into the seriously. Field. Then we'll have a couple of surprises for them. <laughs> oh, I even got a gift wrapped. Stand by. Okay. This is going to be a bumpy ride. He's around here somewhere. If I remember correctly from the movies, it's like, dev. Your move. This won't be much of a fight. All right, where is he? Homing missiles. Splendid. Seismic charge! Brace! Okay, so we're just Close gonna one. go... Dude, just sit still for like a brief moment. I only want to shoot you in the face. Okay, so just... You're making my life more difficult than it needs to be. Uh, where is he? Ah, yes, there you are. Yeah, I appear to have lost the uh, beat on him. I know he's around here somewhere. Uh, there you are. Okay, where is he? Okay, and now I think round one can Can't done. shake me that easily, bounty hunter. I'm not here to play silly. Found you. This is a waste of my talent. <sighs> Anakin would be loving this. Oh yeah, probably, but... I probably should have seen that coming. Yeah, but given how terrible I am at flying, you know, you know how it'd be, Obi. I never claimed to be an ace pilot. 
You never claim to be, but neither did the guy controlling you. Yet Don't here we are. Closer. This is how you want to play it. Fine. Okay, where is he? I only want to talk. Seriously, where is he? Why are the flying controls inverted? Okay, so just... My guy, I can go in circles too, you know. Okay, there we are. Follow the smoke. Seriously, just hold still. I'll make this quick. Aha! I made it quick. What are you hiding, hey. Django? Who hired you? Probably the guy named right Tyrannus. There you are. Why don't you just give up? Because I don't want to. Actually, going into an asteroid field, I must be crazy. Oh, trust me, Obi, you're not as crazy as you may think. Because trust me, you'll never out crazy Anakin. Like, I physically think that would be impossible. Okay, and... There we are. Django, I'm sorry, but this little game of cat and mouse needs to end. Like, now-ish. Just a little- There we go. Get him, Dad, get him! Okay, and... R4, jettison the spare parts. <laughs> Did he just jettison his own body? Four literally just jettison his own body as spare parts. Legend. There's an unusual concentration of Federation ships over there, R4.
man, I wonder what they could be building. It's so subtly, it's too subtly conveyed. Yes, my lord. I trust our plans are proceeding accordingly. Certainly. With these droids, the Republic and the Jedi won't stand a chance. Anakin! Help me! Mom, no! <sighs> you had another nightmare. Jedi don't have nightmares. I saw my mother. I have to help her. I'll go with you. That way, you can continue to protect me. You know, just like in the films, Anakin's uh, first turn to the dark side is actually all Padme's fault. Because Padme's like, nah, go save your mom. Don't do as your code tells you. I haven't seen you this worked up before. Was there a lot of sand in your dream? Yes, a considerable amount, but that's not the point. We just need to get to Mos Espa. I have to make sure my mother is safe. <laughs> ah, Senator Jar Jar. Step aside. It's my turn. Okay, so... There we go. Consider it built. I just want to get off of Naboo as soon as possible. I'm having war flashbacks to Battlefront 2, and now the CPU always wants to go to Naboo. Okay, why does Padme have her midriff here? Seriously, she doesn't get that until he gets sliced off her outfit. God, this game is so inaccurate. Yeah. Amy Star Wars nerd, can you tell? God, I'm... I'm an idiot. Okay, so... Now, these areas are really big. Like, surprisingly. Like, they are large. And also dense. This man... Th this blonde man, he knows what drip is. He wears nothing but yellow, even to having his hair be yellow. Man's got courage and drip. Far more than anything I could have. Over here. I've received an update since you last checked in, you know. But does your life still have meaning, my guy? Okay, and to Tatooine. A large desert planet. And we can talk more about sand! <laughs> you know, the one thing everyone wants to talk about. Sand. Sand and sadness. It's the basis for my entire personality. Of sand and sadness. Uh, We're an independent droid taxi service. No apps, no drivers. All right. Huh? Who's there? Keep your hands off my merchandise unless you plan on paying for it. What up, Watto? <laughs> Watto is with your name. <laughs> Little Annie? Yes, it is I, you Little Orphan sure Annie. Sprouted, <laughs> eh? And the Jedi! Well, I guess he's what not an know? orphan quite yet. My mother. He'll have Where his Batman she? origin soon. Here. I sold her years ago to a moisture farmer named Lars. A business is a business. <laughs> Where is their farm? 
Oh, long away from here. Head out to the desert and look for moisture evaporators. You'll find them. Right, so into the desert we go. No, I feel like I want to take the long way around. Oh, oh, come on. Let me venture out into the vast expanse of nothingness. Can't believe the wastelands is where we need to go. Or at least I think I, I could be wrong. It has been a minute after all. Tatooine, June land wasteland. Oh, I hope we get to do the whole killing sand people bit. It's my favorite part of the film. Good. What a mess. This sand really does get everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> nice little detail. 3PO? Is he vacuuming the sand? Oh, Master Annie, I knew you would return. <laughs> Owen Lars. Is my mother here? No, she's not. Shmi is my wife. She was about halfway home when they took her. A hunting party of Tuscan raiders. <laughs> I get the feeling we are legitimately going are to see going? a bunch of Tuscan raiders find slicing a birthday cake. <laughs> you may not like what you find out there, kid. I don't care. I'm going to find my mother. Master Anakin, I really do think you should... Come on, 3PO. You're coming with me. Oh, dear. <laughs> Excuse me? Just gonna take him with me straight up. Okay, where's where's the weird speeder thing? I don't wanna walk there on foot. Okay, so apparently that doesn't work. Well, when in doubt. Okay, 3PO, where are you? Or, you know, I can always take this. I... I sense something. This way. My mother is here. Somewhere. Mom? Uh, okay, so we're just gonna start the murder early. I will do what must be done. Oh, come on, we don't get to do the mass slaughter of Tuscan Raiders. <laughs> <laughs> 
Why couldn't I save her? What is the point in Star Wars if we don't get to murder a bunch of Tusken Raiders? Anakin, my long-range transmitter has been knocked out. Retransmit this message to Coruscant. I have tracked the bounty hunter Jango Fett, first to a huge cloning facility on Kamino, and then to the droid foundries on Geonosis. Count Dooku is forming a droid army here. Wait. Anakin, stay where you are. Protect the Senator at all costs. We will deal with Count Dooku. They'll never get there in time to save him. I'm going to help Obi-Wan. If you plan to protect me, you'll just have to come along. Yeah, you know me. Supporting your bad decisions, Anakin. Seriously, Padme, this woman... You heard Master Windu. He gave me strict orders to stay here. He gave you strict orders to protect me. Now let's go. Obi-Wan is in danger. You know, I'm just gonna point this out. You know, she says... Oh, you know, I'm gonna support you with, like, all of your bad decisions. And then when you turn to the dark side, I'm gonna be like, Oh, no! How Who could have ever foreseen this coming? And honestly, it's like, if you think about it, literally everyone could, because the Jedi Code basically relies on you denying all forms of emotional attachment. And it's, like, part of the problem and the point. You know, just, just some food for thought, guys. Maybe the Jedi were bad. Hot take, I know. And I'm not saying Padme's, like, solely to blame, but she's, like, part of the reason. Because she basically supports him disobeying direct orders. Alright, gang, I say we split up and look for clues about what happened to Obi-Wan. And by split up, I mean I'm going to ride the cool vehicles. You guys are going to stay right here. Okay. Seriously, there are like a ton of little cool vehicles we get to ride now. Just like hop to it. Oh, sweet, and there's a new one right here. Darn it. Okay. So we gotta get in there, so just... <laughs> Thrifio still doesn't have his legs! Oh, never mind, we can make his legs a second character entirely! <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna do that, because it's funnier. Oh my, we're, we're not going down there, are we? Unless you'd rather try the front door. Now come on, Obi-Wan is down there somewhere. Okay, let's continue the story a bit more. I'm not interested in getting into a war here. Maybe I can find a diplomatic solution to this mess. What diplomatic solution? You're foreign agents. 
Y you are literally agents of the Republic Wait. coming to Geonosis, a place that is not in the Republic and is very much a separatist state. You call this a diplomatic solution? I call it aggressive negotiations. Okay, that works far better in the movies, where that's actually an ongoing gag. These conveyor belts will surely lead us to safety. I see in no way where the conveyor belt solution well, ends horribly. There goes that plan. Care to diplomatically solve this one? With pleasure. Okay, I'm just gonna shoot some things. Hope that it works. Okay, Padme, you're the one with the gun here. Okay, guys, I don't think the Jedi is what you really need to be shooting about. I think you need to be more worried about Rootin' Tootin' Padme over here. If they wanted our help, they would- ah! Great timing, you two. Can you start up those power cells? <laughs> <laughs> okay, it, it's a dumb detail. But I like that they made his arm a different color. So, hold Y. Okay, so, what's the objective? Find a route through the droid factory, okay. Okay, so that's broken. And we can just build a whole uh, little thing here. Okay, just gonna mirror's edge across I that. I am afraid we are not programmed to use systems like this. Come along, Arto. We must find another way to charge those power cells. Uh, have we tried 90 precursor orbs yet? That worked the first time I tried it. There we go. Master Anakin, you will have to charge the last one. Okay, where would it be at? Anakin, can you pass the charge between the cells? Do one better, I can just break this out. Get it all juiced up and then voila. Okay, so now it works for some reason, all right. Okay, what's down here? Why couldn't Obi-Wan go missing somewhere safe and quiet? Ah, yes, so now we get to play through the first time Anakin basically gets his arm cut off. Dooku's droid army must be growing by the hour. 
Yay, into the furnace. Does he work here? Hey, I want to speak to your manager. Oh my god, he's a cannon. He's a Karen. R2, you still there, buddy? Okay, so no. Okay, so we're just gonna da da da. And jump down. Machines building machines. How perverse. I don't think that's the word you're looking for, but okay. Three PO committed murder, and there was nothing in his eyes. No sorrow, no regret, nothing. Three PO knows no such thing. No such thing as sorrow or regret. Only that he must inflict pain and destruction upon the unworthy. But look, we can get the belt back online for Master Anakin and Miss Padme. Okay, and through PO, how do you suggest we do that? Uh huh. Okay, R2, this is a job for you, I suppose. Now what? Obi-Wan is still in serious danger. We have to get through this factory. Anakin, can you get me up there? Or, you know, I can get up there myself. Avoid that burning furnace. There's that legendary Jedi wisdom. Okay. Anakin, where are you? Let's do what you do best. Okay, and just... And down it goes. Okay, uh...
Okay, and now we're just gonna assemble something. Okay, Padme, and... Okay, so rhythm minigame. And we're through. I'm serious now. Where is your manager? Is he on break? Okay, Karen, please stop talking. <laughs> oh, look, slightly... Okay, this might be a bit of a, a tad bit of a problem. If I didn't, if I wasn't the quickest draw on the West. I'm the fastest draw on the West. Haha. <laughs> Padme Amadele. Two, three PO. This way. Come on. Okay, so just glad glad to see the fams back together. Now what? Okay, so. I see no way where this could end poorly. Padme, no! Ah, get off! This Padme! Well, guys, the character of Padme had a good run. I, I suggest we just let things happen. Not so fast. Help! Help! We have to get Padme out of there quick. Yes, perhaps. Please hurry. See anything? Can you shut it down? Any chance you could save me? There isn't much to do in here. Okay, Padme, I'm gonna need just you to respect the boys a little bit. Yeah, it doesn't seem to work. There we go. They Take had a good away. run. <laughs> Missile propose emergency powers to the Supreme Chancellor. Clearly, George Lucas was not intoxicated when he originally wrote this scene, because this actually happens. Jar Jar literally tells the Senate, yes, let's give supreme power to Palpatine. Army of the Republic <laughs> to counter the increasing threats. <laughs> Of the separatists. <laughs> I will take what Jedi we have left and go to Geonosis and help Obi Wan. Visit, I will. The cloners on Kamino. Yes.
We should hurry and get to Geonosis. Obi-Wan may be in real trouble. Yes, best character with Beth's lightsaber. Let's get Samuel Jackson on the case. Let's go. You need a ride somewhere else? Look no further. Where are you traveling to today? You'll be there in no time. To the north landing pad. Okay, and just... I'm sorry, what are these? Yes, the giant walkers! This is great! Man, I love this scene from the movie where Mace Windu just goes mad and starts killing a bunch of civilians on a giant walker. Love this scene. It's literally the best. Best scene from the movie, guys. Okay, let's get to Geonosis and actually get to, you know, fun combat scenes. You know, what was originally the highlight of this movie? You'll never guess what I've got to see from you later. Okay, to Geonosis we go. To the hive. Geonosis. Okay, I have no idea how to pronounce that, so I'm not going to. Okay. Ah, yes, here we go. Come learn some new stuff. Take them down before they can report back to their map. I see nothing wrong with what we just did. Howdy, boys. Alrighty. And let's start the level. See how far we can get. We decided to come and rescue you. Good job. <laughs> Is he using a laser pointer? <laughs> the Geonosians are totally comp. Just totally competent. Just absolute. I've got a bad feeling about this. Uh, uh. <gasps> Just relax, concentrate. What about Padme? She seems to be on top of things. Okay. Da -da -da. I can get you out of those chains. Hold on. Okay, so just here, boy. <laughs> Good job, really, this time. 
What large claws you have. Which one first, Master? Take your pick. I'm not too fussy. Okay, in... We're hurting it. If I'm not mistaken, in the original uh movie one of Obi-Wan's many abilities is he can just communicate with animals. That's it. Let's keep going. Can I ride it? Are you guys really making me fight a fight a poor innocent dog here? That I don't think it can take. Welcome to the bone zone. Nope, nope, that joke does not work. No, I have a giant bone. Couldn't tell. Okay, and now it's down. Master Windu, how pleasant of you to join us. This party's over. Brave, but foolish, my old Jedi friend. You're impossibly outnumbered. <laughs> Dooku's droid army. Obi-Wan was right. Then war will soon begin. Look around, Master. It has already begun. Hello, Django. Bounty Hunter! Stay alert, Masters. This bounty hunter is clever and well prepared. Well, he's up against one of the most skilled Jedi alive. Does he mean me or you? No, obviously, I mean me. So, fun fact, in the original movie, uh, they try to make it very apparent that Django's backpack just is shattered and broken, and no one caught it, so in the special edition, they legitimately had to add sparks and people still complained. It takes more than fireworks and a jetpack to defeat a Jedi. You tell him, Master Windu. Yes, thank you, Master Mundi. Supportive as always. Yari Mundi is literally the worst. Now I kinda wish you got control of like every like every one of the Jedi in the arena, but I understand why you don't. Because that would just break free play. No such thing on Glian Cell. Perhaps Wolrin would insult me more. Okay, just gotta break out the rope. Okay, so he just has a flamethrower now. There we go. Oh, 
<laughs> the dude just straight up got Wicked Witch of the West in... Or, or maybe it was East in... Which one was the one that was crushed by a house? I forget. <laughs> he goes on to be a war criminal. Jedi have amassed a huge army. My master will never allow the Republic to get away with this treachery. Jedi must not find I'll our take point. the designs to Coruscant. They will be much safer there. <laughs> if Dooku escapes, rally more systems to his cause. He will. Look over there. Yes, you could make an entire game out of what Dooku does. I can't leave her. Don't let your personal feelings get in the way. Follow that speeder. Of what? They took away his little, uh... Did they really remove his little speeder? Right, on to Dooku's trail we go. Dooku into that stronghold up ahead. But Padme, she... We have a job to do, Anakin. What do you think Padme would do if she were in your position? She would do her duty. How are we gonna get up there, Master? There will be something in that wreckage we can use. Come. Yes, we could rebuild the entire thing and then, you know, fly up there like absolute Good to see chance. You're alive. We're following Dooku this way, but we took a direct hit. Knock us out of the sky like a sack of Corellian spuds. This gunship isn't much use now, so if you need it for parts or Jedi business, help yourself. Oh, so we just... We made it a trampoline. Okay. What's with these things? Guess it's just aesthetics. Okay, so let's get on the fight with Dooku. You know, the one thing we're all here for. That way we can wait another uh, two weeks for me to play episode three. Just kidding, it would probably be only a single week. We're trapped. Is he really going to... Okay, so we're just going to remove all tension while we it can. It is imperative that Dooku does not escape. We can worry about our exit later. Yes, Master. Which way shall we proceed, Master? It matters not, so long as we reach Dooku before he flees the planet. Okay, so... Okay, just gonna yank. We're 
we're gonna build a flight of stairs. Right, now if I'm not mistaken, we can just hop up here and then... Voila! Open sesame! My, how many of you there are! So through here we go. It's awfully dark in here. Dooku obviously doesn't have many guests. Yeah, least of all Jedi. I like how your lightsaber kind of illuminates the room. Very, uh... Very Star Wars. Seriously, that was one of my favorite details about Jedi Fallen Order, is that your lightsaber could be... Those sections where your lightsaber could be used for, like, illumination. Love those sections. Hinges off a door. Time to make our big entrance. Remember, keep your head. I have a feeling his head's going to fall off. Hello Welcome, there. Welcome, young Jedi. I trust your Padawan is behaving himself. Ah. Hmm. Hey. Ah. <laughs> we'll take him together. You go in slowly on the left. I'm taking you now. No, Anakin, no! Hmm. <laughs> My Jedi powers are far beyond yours. Now back down. I don't think so. How about no? <laughs> Come on, I'm gonna kill you in only a single movie. Let's go. You got nothing. I'll let the locals have their fun with you first. Fight us yourself, Dooku. Or are you tired already? Steady, Anakin. He's trying to rile us up. Don't let him. Down here. We must get him back on our level. Oh, so we can do this to climb. Interesting. Okay, so just. Behold my power. Interfered with our affairs for the last time. Okay, so. I 
I can tap Y more than you can, Dooku. Feel my power. I warned you that my skills surpassed yours. You ain't got anything on me. I am Obi-Wan Kenobi. You know, I do find it sad that they cut out the part where Anakin's dual wielding, but Why do you, you know. Why you from us, Dooku? Are you scared? <laughs> Kenobi, have you taught him nothing? Strategy. He's a slow learner. He hasn't taught him to attain the high ground. Okay, so just. We have to get him back down here. Your that high ground means nothing. Interruption. I guarantee you, I will be much more than mild. Okay, and... Just a bit more. Behold my unlimited power. Master Kenobi, you disappoint me. Powerful you had become, Dooku. CGI Muppets! I, I sense in you. I've become more powerful than any Jedi. Even you. Much to learn. You still have. Behold the powers of CGI Muppets. Master Yoda, how are we going to reach him? An ally to us, the Force will be. Okay, so up. A bit more to the side. Hey there, Dooku. It's me, your boy, Yoda. With all due respect, could you please stop taking the power out? Where is he? Okay, why, 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 why? Why is this happening to me? Powers of a Jedi Master. Yeah, Anakin gets his arm chopped off for real hair. My old Padawan. This is just the beginning. <laughs> Anakin.
And yeah, I think that's the end of Star Wars Episode 2. <laughs> Welcome home, Lord Tyrannis. You have done well. I have good news for you, my lord. War has begun. Excellent. Everything is going as planned. <laughs> And I'm sure nothing terrible will happen in the next episode. Clearly, nothing bad will happen. Nothing at all. But yeah, in the next stream, we will actually be playing Star Wars Revenge of the Sith, you know, the best episode. So, do be looking forward to that, as it were, and I will see you all next Sunday, uh, same place. And we will actually get around to that, and from there we will go on to the original trilogy. And I, I am looking forward to playing through 4, 5, and 6. Also looking forward to episode 7 and 8. We're not going to talk about episode 9. Not yet. Because when we get there, I'm sure I'm going to have a large rant about episodes uh, 6 through 9. So yeah, when we get there, that's going to be fun. Alright, but I'll see you all then. Peace.